All right, now let's talk about articulation. Articulation will make you stand out from other players on this instrument. The vibraphone is not played like a xylophone or a marimba in terms of articulation. Here we have some more choices because of the use of the pedal. I'll get into four different techniques I use for creating different articulation on this instrument. Our goal is to play like a horn player would. Check it out, if you check out the trumpet uh, part for this audition that matches up and play with a trumpet player, you'll have a good chance of sounding very musical. So how do we play like a horn player might on this instrument? Well, we could play completely dry. So my foot is not touching the pedal at all. We get this sound. That's very short, the notes are uh, not connected at all. The second way would be the pedal all the way down, all the time. This creates, all the notes kind of slur into each other and they keep ringing and they, you know, they just keep going. It creates like a cloud of sound, which can be useful, but if we're thinking like a horn player, horn players don't do that. Once they switch their fingering on their instrument, that note's gone. So we'll keep that in mind. In between is something called a half pedal. With the half pedal, my foot is on the pedal, and I'm using the weight of basically my big toe to push down and have the dampener come off the bar only enough for the bar to speak, for it to ring slightly. But it won't be dry, it won't be too ringing, it will be somewhere in between. Take a listen to this sound. If you could see my foot, you would see it barely moving. It really feels like it's the weight of my toe inside my shoe moving that pedal. So it's a very subtle motion, but it'll really help us when we're trying to play like a horn player, when we're trying to play really nice lines. So for instance, uh, if you take a lick which was played just by horn players, like this is a Charlie Parker lick, and I played it totally dry, it would sound like this. So. And it sounds okay, the notes speak clearly, you can hear all the individual notes, but I've never heard a horn player be able to play that short or would want to play that short. If I played it with the pedal all the way down, the entire phrase, you see what happens. Then it becomes a giant mess of sound. The half pedal will alleviate the situation. some notes, some more drier than others, they all speak and they connect a bit, but they don't bleed over and they don't continue to um, ring. So half pedaling is one of the major um, techniques you need to use here to play like a horn player. And the last thing we do as players is uh, do mallet damping. Besides pedaling, we dampen. This is what damping looks like. My foot doesn't move. practical for really fast passages because you have to have your hands moving really quick but it will be really nice in isolated situations. Mallet dampening is our fourth way to create interesting articulation. Now in your next segment I'm going to apply some of these to the actual etude.